Adding stills to your movies may seem like an odd thing to do, but it's really handy for opening titles or presentations. Here's how it's done. In the cutting room, go to the Images tab. Click the Import button, and you can browse around the images on your computer. I'm going to grab this title image and click the plus button to get it into my image clip bin. I'm also going to get this spacey shot and add that too. To get an image into your movie, just drag it to the timeline. It defaults to one second, but you can change the duration by dragging the end out. And we'll add another one the same way. To remove an image, you can click on it in the timeline and delete it. If you click on it in the clip bin, you can remove it from the movie or get rid of it from the clip bin completely. This won't delete it from your computer. And of course, you can split, drag, or delete images just as you do with movie clips. You can also create a blank image. This is useful for putting titles on or just having sections with nothing on screen. Just pick a color and then treat it as any other image and drag it in. We'll add one here so we could add a title in. And one at the start so we can hear the music start before the opening title. For more effects, you can add filters to images. The rest of the movie is in black and white, so we'll do the same for these images.